alert, in this video, we are going to give you some terrible information. Report, confidential from a human being, who was kidnapped to work as a slave in the underground tunnels of Mars. Internal report on underground tunnels on Mars. Subscribe to the channel. This report is so unbelievable, that our brain simply cannot assimilate this information. We will not give any opinion on the veracity of this anonymous person's information, I leave that to your discretion. However, this story is too plausible and structured to be denied. Listen and draw your conclusions. The surface of Mars is an inhospitable, arid and oxygen-free place, due to deadly solar radiation, which reaches the planet without the protection of a magnetosphere as it does on Earth. According to this human being, we are going to catalog him as dimensional on his initiative. Humanity on Earth does not know that under the Martian soil, there is an ecosystem of microbial life, and a world of constructions in tunnels where in the past there were traces of lava. Several humans were taken from Earth to build authentic underground cities across the Martian planet for centuries. We ask you, how do humans survive in undergrounds and tunnels without oxygen? The dimensional responded categorically. The Martian subsoil is supported by a vast network of nuclear energy. A process that makes life possible in the Martian underground. This happens because in the crevices and pores, underground on Mars, there is water, so a radiolysis process was developed. This allowed for the creation of a self-sustainable world in the Martian subsoil, where food and all basic goods of human life are sustainable. According to the Dimensional Insider, Mars was once the same as planet Earth, in the history of the Martian people they report an unprecedented astronomical event, which placed the planet completely out of its former orbit. Before Mars had tides, forests and oxygen. According to the Insider, the solar system had more planets than we know today. We asked whether humans on Mars today remember planet Earth. The insider replied that they are descendants of the first human inhabitants, men and women, taken as slaves from the Earth centuries ago. Today, Martian humans have slightly different morphological characteristics than you do. However, they are highly intelligent and have more advanced technology than on Earth. Due to lack of resources, they became self-sufficient and developed technology for collective protection and self-defense. To get an idea, the Martians have a unique interstellar teleportation technology in the solar system. They manage to fragment matter into energy and vice versa. Science on Mars is light years away from Earth. Due to the astronomical cataclysm they had, they develop technologically, to protect themselves from the next event that will happen. We ask you how governance works on Mars. The insider responded that Martians don't live like Earthlings do on Earth. On Mars there is only one government composed of hierarchies of intelligence, the laws are restricted and programmed in the brain of all humans, there is no possibility of crime or civil disobedience. Everyone knows their rights and duties. Martians are a united people, and in their genetic code the survival of their race is most important for the collective good. We ask if the Martians have a defense army. The insider replied that the Martians are conquering warriors, due to the lack of resources on their planet, they look elsewhere in the galaxy, and make use of the extraordinary technology systems they have. According to the insider, Martians only fear stellar distortion, caused by gravitational interference from celestial bodies entering our solar system. We asked if the first humans taken to Mars left their beliefs to today's Martian descendants. The insider responded that the mindset of Martian humans descended from the first Earthling humans is completely erased. They live for the collective good, and for the survival of their race, that is their only law. We asked the insider if he is part of the first humans, he replied that he is, and he is on Earth for a limited time. Time on Mars is different than on Earth, they age later due to their technology. We asked if the governments of the Earth would believe his story. The insider responded in an amazing and admirable way, saying that all Earth's space agencies and their governments know everything about the Martian world, in fact Martians consider Earth their brother planet, and Earthlings their parents. 
the Martians would never harm the Earth, on the contrary the Martian hierarchy works hard with the terrestrial elite in order to find a solution, for what they fear most, the astronomical cataclysm that is coming. We ask if the UFOs that humans have seen on Earth today are Martian apparatuses. The insider replied no. Martians move through dimensional teleportation portals. However he warned us that the solar system is not what we think there are other civilizations. We think this Martian dimensional being of this account, unbelievable. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications to receive new videos.